Hello everyone, I'm Rachel from the Innisfil Idea Lab and Library and in today's tips and tricks we're going to learn more about the clip tool in Inkscape. Now this is a fun tool where if you want a certain image and you want to remove that background you can do that. Or if you want to take a background and use that as your colors for your image or text you can also do that. So let's get started. Now I have uh, two images here. I have my text that I want to use and I have the background that I want this to get turned into. So I want this color to become colored in this text. So I'm going to go up to the path menu. I'm going to hit trace bitmap and I'm going to hit update and OK. Now I've just converted my text to a vector and you can see that because it has a transparent background where this image that I brought in does not and we can remove that. Now I'm going to make it a little bit bigger and I'm going to open up the fill and stroke options so I can go under object and click fill and stroke. So for this I want a stroke but I do not want to fill. This will be able to let me see what colors will get filled in. Now I've made it as big as I'd like to. I'm going to hold down shift and I'm going to select my colorful background here. Underneath the object menu if you go to clip and you hit set you now have that background cut away and then your text becomes very colorful with those images. Now if you just want to cut out an, an object you can do that as well. I like to use the Bezier tool for this step and I'm going to click and just kind of go around the edges of my image. So I'm going to go very quickly here. And as I get to the very end, when I click the square here, it'll now make it another cut line. If you want, you can zoom in and you can adjust it by going to your edit path tool and you can move the nodes around if you'd like, or you can even just delete them. So that's an option. Okay, so let's cut out that background. I'm going to go back to my move tool and I'm going to hold down shift and I'm also going to click the background. So I have two objects selected. I'm going to go up to the object menu click on clip and hit set. And now it's removed the entire background. So that's a couple of different options that you can use for the clip tool in Inkscape. Again, I'm Rachel from the Innisfil Idea Lab and Library, and you just learned your tips and tricks for the week. Take care and have a great day.